I like to come to school early so that I can hang out with my friends, talk to them, maybe review some homework, and just hang out. So first class I had today was Spanish class and we got into class and we started practicing for our summative. Um, so I had a formative with my teacher and he gave me some feedback about um, conjugating verbs. So then my friends and I made a song and we performed it to our class because it was about the book we were reading. And it's quite fun because we perform a lot of things in Spanish class and we do some like pieces of theater. Um, and some people just like to volunteer and make a kahoot for the whole class. At the end of class, we were playing quizzes, which is a quiz, um, but it's also a game and it's really fun because it helps us memorize. So often we do kahoots, quizzes, quizlet to memorize our vocabulary, but still have fun. So then I had snack break and we just went outside, played. So this is the middle school playground and I'd like to come here with my friends because it's only for middle school and so there's not too many people on the playground and it's just fun to enjoy uh, for our break. It's also very fun because the weather in Budapest is very nice during the summer and so we get to just enjoy the beautiful weather outside and sometimes during advisory we also get let out and we can just play around for 30 minutes. In advisory, um, other than going out outside, we've been talking about COVID and our school has been trying to help people around Hungary. So right now we have a food drive going on, which is where people can bring in foods that we can give to others. Uh, and then we look in our advisory, we look at foods that we don't have enough of. And so then we try to bring those in in the next few days. My next class was math. Um, for math, we always have a daily goal, and then our teacher will kind of explain the daily goal, and we'll have a warm-up question, which we'll have some time to do, and then he'll show the whole class how to solve that problem. We also have the chance to do our own problems, and we have about 20 minutes to just do our own problems and ask any questions that we want more towards the end of the class. Our teacher makes us feel very comfortable in class because I personally am not scared to ask any questions and I know that my peers aren't scared to ask questions either. Um, and we're all very respectful of each other uh, whenever someone has a question that I may understand but they might not understand, we're still very respectful. During lunch, we have different places where we can eat. So we can eat in the cafeteria or there's multiple places outside where we can eat. So my friends and I usually eat outside since the weather is very nice. And then once we're done eating, we go outside. Outside, there's multiple options as well. There's some monkey bars down at the field or there's the playground where I was at during break. After lunch, I had science class. So today's science class was a bit different because my teacher wasn't at school. So he was projected onto the screen and he gave us a task to do, which was um, comparing cities in different time periods. So for example, in the 2000s and in the 1900s. And then we could do that talking to others, sharing our ideas, sharing our different cities we found and how they changed. So I found out that Los Angeles had a drastic change because it used to be fields uh, used for agriculture, but now it's a big city. At the very end of class, I had one-on-one -on -one feedback with my teacher and we went to a separate room and he gave me some feedback about my summative that we did a couple of classes ago. So my last class of the day was PE, and at the very beginning of PE, we have 10 minutes to just play around. So me and my friend played some basketball, and then we had another 10 minutes to work on our fitness goal, which in my case is stretching. So me and my friend did some yoga outside. After stretching, we went back inside and we practiced some handball as this is our unit. So we were in small groups and we threw the ball around um, to practice and then at the very end of class we had about 20 minutes to
to play a big game all together of handball. Even though my day is very busy, the teachers make it very comfortable, fun, and enjoyable to be at school.